so hello everybody how are you today in today's video i am actually going to show you how you can decide in power query if you want to do the transformation in the same column or in a new column and this is very useful to know two reasons number one sometimes you want it in a new column sometimes you don't number two if you click wrong you might think that something's up let me show you okay so we have here the north wind data set that we always use and the uh, what I want to do, let's go to, for example, the customer table, and I want to split company names. So, or, for example, the contact name, I want to get the first name out. So there is one um, function that is called extract that really will allow you to do that. But look at this. You have transform extract and you have add column extract. They do exactly the same thing. The difference is add column extract will do the extract in a new column let me show you so if we go here and i do text before the limiter space it will add a new column at the end and this is a large column so you don't see it you have to go and scroll there to see it there you have it okay but if instead of doing it here we go to transform extract text before the limiter and you do like that, it'll do it here on the column that you're on. And the difference is important. So you see, it took away the surnames and then it just give, so, so depending on you wanted to do, for example, you just want to have a column with name because you didn't have it, but you still want to have the column with everything, you would do add column extract, otherwise you will do this. And something that happened to me quite often is that I go, uh, I think, I go to transform extract, but I'm not. I'm doing add column extract. And then I say, oh, it didn't work. What's up? Because, you know, it goes to the last uh, column and it. I was not supposed to do that. Either way, it is a very short trick, but it's actually useful to know. Obviously, not all the functionality is available in there. You'll see the difference. Transform has a lot more functions that add column. And you know, our column has obviously a few functions that transform does not have because it requires a new column to be able to do it. So it wouldn't make sense to put it in transform. But do you see the difference? And now you know how to use it and when, okay? So again, short trip, tick, <laughs> short trick. Uh, I hope you are having a great vacation. If you are on vacation, I'll see you again on the next video. So until then, take care and bye-bye.